All right, guys, today we're making loaded cauliflower. Let's get started. You want to boil the cauliflower for about 15, 20 minutes until it's nice and tender. You want to get about four long bacon strips, cut them in half, put them in your skillet. Once the bacon's ready, you want to dice it up into small little bites. Then we're going to need some sour cream, some onion, garlic powder, salt and pepper, and some sharp cheddar shredded cheese. And I'll give you guys the exact measurements in the description. That's what it looks like. All right, pull out that cauliflower, drain it out. All that excess water, you wanna mash it up. Like I'm doing so right here. You wanna mash it up too much. You wanna season it. And you wanna add the bacon bits. And you wanna add the sour cream and half a cup of cheese. You wanna mix that all up and then you're gonna add the remaining bacon and the remaining cheese at the end. So you wanna go ahead and bake this for 20 minutes at 350 degrees. Once that's done, pull it out. That's how it looks like. You want to top it off. You want to top it off. Top it off with another half cup of cheese. Spread that all out. Gonna want to add a little bit of uh, more bacon and some more green onion. Gives it a nice presentation. Some nice color. There you go. Put it back in, 350 degrees for another five minutes, and that's how it looks like when it comes out. Once you got your cheese all melted. There you have it. Ready to serve. And I made some wings to go along with it. Check that out. The finished product, and I made some wings to go along Great with it. Great side dish for, uh, for some wings. Uh, the lighting kind of sucks. There's my little wing setup. Thanks for watching. Let's see more of this right here.